Hello and welcome. I'm Angela of Stamping Beauty in Christchurch, New Zealand, and today I'm sharing with you how to make this um, super quick congratulations card. All the products I'm using today will be listed in the description box below and can be purchased via my online store. And if you live in New Zealand and would like a copy of the latest Stamping Up catalogue, please contact me. I'd love to send one to you. So let's get started. Firstly, I've just got a basic white card base. This here. And then I've got this white layering panel and it's just slightly smaller than the card base. And I'm going to be using the layered florals 3D embossing folder. So we'll just pop that into the folder. And then I'll just bring in my Stampin' Up machine. just going to run that through so if you're doing a pile of these you just want to do this step all together and do as many as you want done and this card would work with any sentiment and then I just want to adhere that onto the card base just use glue for this. And because it is um, embossed, sometimes it just takes a little bit longer to adhere. And what I like to do is just get one of my big blocks and just pop it on just to keep it in place. Then I want to uh, die cut this um, gold banner. Just move that slightly out of the way and just die cut that on here. And once again, if you were doing a whole pile of these, just do them all at once. little hole just means you can poke that out and it comes out of there and next we want to um, just pop that over there we want to stamp our sentiment and I'm just going to use this sentiment here congratulations out of the something fancy stamp set There. I'm going to emboss it, so I'll just use some of my embossing buddy to help with the static. I'll try and get it to get that a little straighter, although I will be trimming it down so it won't matter too much. Stamp that onto there. Pop the white emboss powder over the top. I'll just heat and boss that, won't be a second. Now if you have a die that will fit that, you can die cut that, but I'm just going to trim it down. As you can see, I didn't really get it very straight after all that, so... Straighten that up now. And with the trim, I can get it down smaller too if I like. So 
these lines across here are good for lining up too, to get it nice and straight. It's going to sit from there, so that's good. So now it's just a matter of assembling it really. Um, so what I want to do is pop those on dimensionals onto there. And just some half ones will work perfectly for that. So I'll just pop a couple of half ones there. And then I just want to get that onto here so it's nice and straight and even at both ends. And then I'm just going to add glue. Just, I didn't make it very straight after all that. Just adjust that slightly. That off. That's better. A bit of glue. And then I'm just going to get about there. And you could do these this with any sentiment at all. And then I'm just going to use these um, gold um, pearls from the Blooming Pearl set. One up here, small one there, and another small one down there. And just to make sure that does stay in place, I do the same thing again, just put a block over it just until it's um, adhered properly. And that is my card for today. So thanks for watching, and um, I'll catch up with you again soon. Bye for now.